hair. It look good. And I love it. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and I'm back with another freaking YouTube video. And I told you guys that I had a couple of videos coming for you guys and one of them was going to be a wig, wig tutorial and I did not lie, I am doing the wig tutorial today. So I'm about to say bye bye to this wig, well I'm not actually about to say bye bye, I'm going to keep the wig, I'm just about to like, you know, clean it and put it up and put it in the storage bin with all of the rest of my wigs. So, stay tuned, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this video, subscribe to my channel. Once you see this video, follow me on IG at topnotch.ashanti, follow me on TikTok at Lush with Ashanti, and we're about to get straight into this anger. So, I was already starting a TikTok um, of the wig, of like unpackaging the wig. I always do unpackaging TikToks. But this is the bag that the wig came in and I am going to put the link of, of the wig in the description below so, so that you guys could click that link and find the wig. Um, it is a body wave wig. Um, I like this bag though. I do. It zips up and then it zips down. I like this wig bag. But um, this is what came in the wig. It was a wig cap that came in the wig. Um, it, it looks like a lightweight cap, like a beige. And then you got um, a edge brush. I have plenty of these. I love when um, the wigs come with edge brushes because I be needing these. These come in handy. And baby, it got a comb. Y'all, and listen, I just recently had a comb like this. It was pink, but it broke. It like broke. It got messed up when I was doing Lonnie's hair and it broke in half. So. Thank God I got a new I'm so happy. They hurt my um the back of my head a little bit. But these bands, yes, they keep your wig locked in case you don't want to glue it on there all the time. That's what that that's for. And it looks like it got some baby hairs. Be like baby. some baby hairs right there at the front. Which I always make my own baby hairs, but it looks pretty good. It's pretty natural, it's pretty thick. And we're gonna see what this wig looks like on my head. So before I bleach this wig, I always like to spray my um, lace bond on you to the hair to push it back. So this is how the wig look at the moment. Um, right now I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna comb this hair back just to get it, keep it from me bleaching the hair. I don't wanna bleach the hair, I wanna bleach the knot. You bleach the hair, you're gonna mess up pretty bad. You just want the knots bleached, not, not the hair. So I'm gonna push this back. Push that no, no. back. Okay. bleach the hair so make sure that hair is completely pushed back to where you can see nothing on an outline right there and um so that the hair do not bleach and the knots just
you guys I just reinstalled my lace and what I'm doing now is I'm just kind of like pressing it out with the pressing comb because the first time I installed it I barely had glue I had to go to the store and re-up on some glue so I'm gonna reinstall this wig I'm still gonna add the videos together so that you guys can see me process this wig but I am gonna reinstall it because I just feel like I did not have enough glue and it just didn't look like that way so This is the final result to my hair. Y'all, I just redid it though. Like, I kind of reinstalled it. Okay, y'all, I feel like my hair looks way better than the first time. Um, this wig is pre plucked. Um, I just redid like the sideburns and the edges and like the swoop. I, I, I honestly recurled it too. Um, that took a little time. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you guys comment below. And follow me on TikTok and Instagram. And yeah, I'll be back with another video soon. Y'all, I should finish my hair. It look good. And I love this filter, so don't mind me with the filter. But... 
you'll see the detail in it in the edges. Looks good. I've been